We've... Holy smokes, that's gonna be sweet. That is awesome. More RV upgrade projects. Welcome back to my channel. So behind me here is my truck and a more ride slide out tray that we're going to install in my friend Gary's ORV 24 RLS. It's a Timber Ridge. I picked this up at a warehouse that I deal with and uh, hauled it over here to our camping trip in my truck. It's a 20 inch wide by 90 inch long and it's a 60% slide out. So it slides out 60% in each direction and it's got a locking handle here. So I got my truck backed up right next to his rig here. So all we pretty much have to do is just slide it and it'll go right in. Looking at the bottom of it, you can see the big heavy duty roller bearings right there. And it's got a piece of wood with carpet on it and the carpet's in the top and then here's our mounting holes we have one there another one there so there's two on each side for a total of four on each end and then there is some mounting holes in the middle too it's a really nice tray 800 pound capacity. Look at that, that's gonna be so sweet. We're just kind of doing some final measurements. Yeah, we're kind of trying to evaluate which way we want to shove this. So it looks like we're going to push it up against this wall. That way we have a bunch of extra space here. And then with this sloped wall, tall things like folding tables or whatnot, you can lean those up against the, the front wall here. That's yeah. our logic anyway. Yeah, scoot, your, uh, scoot the uh, other side towards the wall a little bit. I'm like two and a half. Oh, the other way, front wall, towards the front wall. Yeah, right there. Yeah, two and a half. Wow. Two and a half, two and a half. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> I just eyeballed it and we got it right on two and a half. Yep. Let's check our end again. Went with millimeters, so we're eight. So this is seven, so we get that. It's gonna be right about that's seven and you ready? Ready. Okay, we'll do two more on the other side. Pull the tray towards you. We're just putting some small screws in here temporarily because that's all we've got with us. Holy smokes, that's gonna be sweet. That is awesome. That is awesome. Are you kidding me? I don't have to reach in the center anymore. <laughs> See if it comes out as far on this end. No, it doesn't come out as far on this side. But that's good. So it's like 60% on that side and 40 on this? I guess so, yeah. That's still, uh, it still gives you access to uh, the whole thing. Yeah. Which is, which was fine. Which side do you get in and out of the most? This, well, probably that side with all the plumbing and wires. Oh yeah. So cords and hoses and. So I guess we uh, we did the right side, the long side by accident. Yeah. <laughs> nice. 
if you look close here, you can see a gap that we've got between this. Of course, this part doesn't slide out. This is the part where you need to be concerned with clearance if you're gonna push this up against one side of your cargo door. So there's about an inch between the edge of the tray and then that little latch mechanism for our cargo door. close it you just want to make sure that that latch drops down holy smokes that's gonna be sweet that is awesome that is awesome are you kidding me I don't have to reach in the center anymore 